came here to ask a couple of questions, Pavel Zložil, who is a world-class coach for tennis. Okay, so what made you to choose tennis for your life? Uh, different occasions. Uh, I choose. I didn't choose tennis for my life at all. Uh, first thing, uh, back to in Opava when I was seven years old, we did play all kind of sports. So soccer, hockey, you know, stable tennis in the winter, and tennis was just badminton. Tennis was part of those sports, so skiing, and uh, so those days nobody really said, oh, I would like to have my son or daughter to be professional tennis players. It was just for fun. We play sports and then my best results were in tennis. Mm -hmm. And when I was nine, ten years old, we chose to play a few tournaments and uh, was successful and I continued to play tennis. Okay. And what do you think is the difference between good and great tennis player? Yeah, we have a lot of good tennis players and not many great tennis players. And uh, uh, talking about Steffi Graf, she was great, of course, and I was good. <laughs> and so different between me and her was uh, probably, you know, physically much stronger, mm -hmm. mentally much stronger, you know, uh, daily working hard, you know, Saturdays, Sundays, holidays. Uh, I wasn't, for example, I was good, but I wasn't great because, because of that. I didn't like to travel, you know, and that, all kind of things. So that's a probably difference. Mm -hmm. But what made her to choose you as her coach? A few different things. I heard that uh, first uh, Peter Graf told me one time that uh, he chose me because he saw me taking good care of my little Jana daughter at that mm -hmm. time. She was only two, three years old and still playing in the tournaments. And also I was a very good doubles player. And I think what was missing in Steffi Graf's game was to come to the net more often, mm -hmm. be more aggressive and also I was still at the time a really good player so I was at the same time a good sparring partner for her. Okay. And the last question, what do you consider the biggest milestones in your life? In tennis? In your life in general, it's up to you. <laughs> no, tennis, tennis was great for me and still it is and I'm so happy here in Naples, Florida. Uh, milestones. Uh, of course, on the court, winning a couple of tournaments as a singles player, almost 33 or 4 tournaments in doubles on ATP Tour. But of course, the biggest probably was the winning Davis Cup 1980 uh, for Czechoslovakia against Italy. It was probably the, the highlight of my tennis career. Do you have kids? I have a daughter. She's 31 years old. She's in Austria now and living in Caprun, Zalamze, Austria. Is she in sports? Uh, not as much as I am or I was, uh, but because she's living in, uh, in the mountains, so she knows how to ski, wow. mountain yeah. bike, all those, how she can swim, she, she can play tennis a little bit, so, mm -hmm. like me when I was seven. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, so thank you so much for today's interview and good luck for the match. Thank you. We are Dominica. looking forward. <laughs> thank you, Dominica.